My name's Jarmel and I am from Philly and I make art, mostly functional ceramics, under the name of Jarmel by Jarmel. I make art because I gotta get that shit out of me. I can't keep it in, I'll explode. I'll explode confetti. <laughs> I feel like little phrases and combinations of words have always been a part of my artwork. And like even when I draw and stuff like that, there will be a scene and then like little phrases inspire you how to feel. You see so many like even men making like art with like boobs in it and there's like so much like boobs and like feminine and it's like okay well I'm just gonna make a really cute dick. Jealousy is like one of my favorite human emotions. And I don't, I don't view it as a negative thing at all. It can be as positive as you want it to be. And it's like such a strong emotion from like jealousy that you get over people. Like if you're jealous of your significant other, it's just like, what a great thing to have someone in your life that invokes these feelings. In art, like it's just nice to inspire and be inspiring and like all of this, it's just such a cool thing. It motivates you, you know, to be better and to like, I think that stuff's so great. I try to channel as much as I can into my dreams or if I'm having a hard time thinking about something, I'll try to think about it before I go to bed and then like kind of let my mind like do its thing in the, in the night. Normally if I dream about it, I make it. Also, so sometimes I make it in my dream, but then there will be times that like, even though I dreamt it, like someone else in my dream made it. And I'm like, damn, I wish that I made that. And then I wake up and I'm like, oh, I can make that. <laughs> that was my dream. <laughs> Those ones are kind of cool to be like a little like jelly in your dream and then be like, oh, <laughs> cool. <laughs> He's starting to come alive a little bit here. People call this a jaguar a lot, but a jaguar's spots are actually different. The, anytime someone usually says it right, they're like a seven-year-old. <laughs> like, yeah, I don't know when in life we forget. <laughs> it feels really good to make this stuff and I like think it's really cute and like this horse, I'm like glazing it and I'm just seeing it take on its own personality and like come alive and for other people to see it and like I feel that too. It's like such a great thing. So I feel lucky that I can do that even though it's a lot of work and I'm tired a lot. <laughs> I make my slogan, add in sunshine and rainbows to this six sad world. Cause like, that's just what should happen. There should just be more sunshine and rainbows in like this fucked up world. <laughs> like, ah. I'll be like. <laughs> oh, hi, I'm John. <laughs> Take 52.